Motorola's first true flagship in years could be about to land, as we have heard a number of rumors about a high-end Motorola Edge Plus. Renders shared by Evan Plus, a reputable leaker, show the design in full, including the mention of a 108MP camera lens. That's a megapixel count that had been rumored before, but previous render leaks didn't include the text specifying it. Other details which we have seen before include a steeply carved screen with minimal bezels, a single lens punch hole camera and at least three lenses along with a couple of other sensors on the back, mostly housed in a large camera bump. The Motorola Edge Plus looks like it might quite chunky, although it's hard to say for sure and it's pictured here in both a burgundy red and a grey or dark blue shade, so those are two colors that it's likely to be available in. As ever with leaks, we would take this with a pinch of salt, but there are no red flags that we can see and it comes from a reputable source. As for when the Motorola S Plus might launch, April 3 is written on the screen, so that's a possibility and given the number of leaks, we would certainly expect it soon. When it does land, it might not be alone, there could be few other models as well. Now let's go to the Motorola E6s update. Motorola has a history of making very cheap smartphones that are still surprisingly good and the newly announced Moto E6s could be the next one of these. Certainly it has got the cheap part down because it's just $99. For that money, you get a phone with a 6.1 inch LCD screen, a 2GHz MediaTek Helio P2 chipset, 2GB of RAM, and a dual lens rear camera with a 13MP main lens and a 2MP depth sensor. The Moto E6s also has a 5MP front facing camera, 32GB of storage, a micro SD card slot, a 3000mAh battery, a rear facing fingerprint scanner, and comes running Android 9 Pie. The phone sports a water repellent design too, so it's likely to survive an accidental spill. Fairly basic specs then, but no worse than you'd expect for what it costs. Oddly though, its specs are almost identical to the Moto E6 Plus, a phone which also has a similar price tag. So it might struggle to stand out unless Motorola discontinues that phone. Although the Moto E6 S is a slight step up from the Moto E6 Play at least, in both specs and price. If you are interested in the Moto E6 S, UK buyers will be able to pick it up in the coming weeks from Amazon, Argos, John Lewis. Carphone Warehouse O2 or Tesco, but if you can't wait, the other members of the E6 range are already available. Well, that's all for now. Thank you for watching this video, and don't forget to subscribe to this channel to get more updates. 